The Huntsville-Madison County Public Library System moved forward with new policies despite changes last week to the APLS code. This includes adding language stating the library will, will not, quote, exclude materials solely due to the subject matter dealing with topics deemed controversial at any given time, end quote. It also puts the burden on parents when it comes to allowing their children to read books deemed inappropriate for children. Some residents praise the changes for strengthening the library's stance on intellectual intellectual freedom, while others criticize the move. It's wrong. And not only that, you're going to cost this library $500,000, because that's how much the state gives you every year. $500,000, a half a million dollars, actually it's more. And you want to sit here and say this is okay. I come to you today to talk about how the current moment that we are in is a moment for our library system to be a leader in the state to push back against what we can now safely say is not just an attempt to censor materials, but is actually a move towards banning content in our libraries. According to the board, these changes have been in the works for months and the policy can be further changed.